what's up everyone welcome back this is the last and final episode of the series um incredible guys i can't believe i finally made it to the end of this journey it's a crazy journey out here in the land of the rising sun so obviously i had to rep my japan jersey today but anyways i am right now in minato city i believe or chuo city i'm um, here staying near uh, ginza near uh, tsukiji market um, so yeah, today I'm going to be heading over to watch uh, Kawasaki uh, Frontel take on um, uh, Kashiwa Racel. And I believe it's going to be at Todoroki Park. I think that's how you pronunciate it. But yeah, so the game's not till 5 p.m. It is uh, 12.24. So I have a few hours to explore. Um, yeah, it's not too far away from here. I think it's like an hour at most. Yeah. So my plan right now is to head down to uh, uh, Tokyo Tower. I want to uh, go check that out. And I don't I don't know what else I uh, have in store. But yeah, man, I can't believe I made it to the final stop, guys. So today is my last day in Japan. Uh, I will be flying out, flying back home tomorrow. So yeah, today is my full, my last full day here. And what it, what a time it's been. <laughs> it's insane, guys. It has been a, quite an experience. Definitely by far my best trip of all time. Like I met so many great people, made so many uh, precious memories. And yeah, man. I mean, it was an incredible journey. I'm still kind of like in disbelief that I'm leaving tomorrow. I mean, it is what it is. Got to find a way back here. The weather's a bit weird today. It's like cloudy, it's a bit windy, but then uh, the sun will break in as well. Hey right, guys. Just got to Tsukiji Station. I will be taking the Hibiya line down to I'm not sure what station I think Shimbashi station yeah. cool guys just got to Kamiacho station where I will be walking from here 10 minute walk to Tokyo Tower super excited I haven't been to Tokyo Tower since I've been here and it's legit one of my favorite places to go here in Japan so such a beautiful monument they have a sky tree, I went on sky tree, and even then, Tokyo Tower, there's just something like a nostalgia factor, I guess you could say. I believe it's this way. Do you see? There's a break in the clouds now. Wow. She is absolutely magical. Like I said, this is easily one of my favorite places to come to. Surprisingly though, I mean going up there is cool. I've been up there maybe two, three times at most. But it's I wouldn't say it's the best view. Just because she's not part of the view. <laughs> Otherwise it would be. But yeah, so I don't think I'm going to be going up to uh, up today. No, it's, it looks a little different than last time. I might have came through a different way. No, it felt like Chris when it came through. So let's go in here. Maybe I'll go check out the store. So I've been seeing a couple of cosplayers out here. It's pretty sick. I'm tempted to get a drink. Same kind of mouth. Yeah, so I might just go inside, but I'm not going to the top, yo. There's like a whole 
bunch of uh, cosplayers, it seems. There's a convention going on. There might be. So yeah, this is the... Oh no, you gotta get your tickets over there. Ticket counter. And then you line up here to go up. I believe they have two observation decks here on two different floors. I used to love coming here because uh, they used to have the One Piece uh, like Tokyo Tower. Um, I don't want to say theme park, but it was like a whole ordeal. And it was sick, yo. I love coming to that. It was honestly the best thing about Japan. <laughs> it's kind of sad that they took it away. Now I don't know what to do. Oh, this is Red Tokyo Tower. This is new. Yeah, I don't know if they have any other installments or whatever. Keep crying in the back. Little stores. You got a whole food court in here. I had fucking no idea. Crazy. I'm wondering what I'm gonna eat today. So this is the official store. Alright guys, just got a couple souvenirs from here. I think it was a total of uh, 4,400, 4,400. Yeah, I bought um, like two plush keychain and one regular keychain. And what else did I get? I got like one other thing. I think a magnet. So, not too bad. Anyways, I'm heading off. And I don't know where I'm going. I need to go get more souvenirs, but I'm not sure as to where. We'll find out in a second. Let's go outside real quick. So, uh, that's the mascot. Oh, I got top left. Chainsaw man. Alright. So I'm going to be heading over to Daimon Station. Catching the Asukusa line and making my way down to Kawasaki now. Wow, look at the clouds. Yeah, I figured I might as well start heading that way. I've never been this way. So apparently there's like a little park or something. I think over there is Roppongi Hills. I think that's the Mori, uh, yeah, it's the Mori building. It's the Mori Art Museum. You can actually go up there. I think I might, um, I hear the view from up there at night is spectacular. Because you can obviously see that. Look at that. Boom. Gorgeous. Yeah. So right now, look at this. This is gorgeous, man. Can I see? I just stumbled across this temple. I believe it's a Sozoji temple. Wow, that's dope. I've never been here. I've never been to this part of town. I always just um, come from the other side because I always come from uh, Roppongi. This time I came from Ginza, but now I'm going towards somewhere else. That's sick. It looks like it's closed though. Closed off. Let's try and go through the main. Quite nice. Let's take off. Yeah, so I think this area is uh, Asakusa, I mean Asakusa, sorry, uh, Midtown. I believe this area is Midtown. Here we go, just arrived at Hamamatsucho. And train passes in like one minute. Oh shit, let's go, let's get it. All right, y'all, just got to Kawasaki Station. I'm gonna be making my way out and heading to Anime. See what I can buy. I 
don't believe I've ever been to Kawasaki, so this is a first for me. It's possible that I transferred through here, but I, I can't really recall. Feels great, man. Yeah, so I'm hoping to finish my uh, last minute uh, souvenir gift shopping here. If not, I do have all morning tomorrow, so I'd rather just get it out of the way, pack everything up tonight, and yeah, be ready for tomorrow's flight. Hey. Alright guys, I just did this capture and I literally capsule one and I literally pulled Kilua on the first try. Crazy! I love it. That's exactly who I wanted. They're all pretty lit characters. Now I'm gonna try for this one. Can't tell who I got. Oh, I got Beckman. So I pulled these two for 600 yen. Pretty cool. I was hoping for God to stop, but I will take Kilo. Anyways, um, I don't know what I'm gonna do now. I'm getting hungry, so maybe I should find somewhere to eat before the game starts in two hours. Alright, guys, so I think I'm just gonna head over to the stadium. Maybe I'll eat something there. I do want a small snack though, so I'm gonna pass by here at 7-Eleven real fast. Maybe for a pork bun or something. But yeah. I kind of feel like this trip here to the station was kind of a pointless, just because uh, I was coming for anime, but I didn't find what I was looking for. Back to Kawasaki Station, and I'm gonna be taking the JR. I think the Namba line, and that's gonna take me uh, quite close to the stadium. And then, yeah. Last stop guys, so excited. Um, let's see how the stadium itself is. Uh, I know that, I hope the atmosphere will be amazing. I feel like it, it should. Kawasaki is a pretty good um, team in terms of the fan base. But, I don't know, see what, uh, see what there is. I know that the stadium itself, it has like a track. So that's always a bummer, but it, it's cool. I still expect it to be a fun time. Um, hopefully it's a good match. I think it should be Kawasaki Kashima. I mean, it's not Kashima. Ka uh, uh, Kashiwa. Yeah, it's gonna be a good game. So let's see how it turns out. Um, I don't know what my prediction is actually. Now I think about it. Honestly, I feel like Kashiwa can come up with the upset. I say Kashiwa wins it. Two to one. Two to one. Let's see how it turns out. Let's look back at Kawasaki. To track number five or six. All right, guys, just got to Musashi Nakahara Station, and I'm about to exit. I believe uh, the stadium is around 15 to 20 minutes away. Walking, I thought it was going to be closer, but I guess not. Which is fine. It's only 3:24, so it's a good amount of time. So the game starts. This 
I'm gonna go get some bread. I'm gonna get this. This is pretty good. Hey right, guys, this is what I'm getting. So excited to try these. Should be less than a grand. All right, cool. Secured the bag, guys. <laughs> I got three pieces of bread. Actually, pretty fair price. Seven hundred fifteen yen. This is gonna be my meal for right now. Yeah. Uh, now I'm gonna start walking to the stadium, but I won't pass by for a drink because I'm thirsty and I want to eat something. I mean, drink something with this. So I'm going this way. Honestly, if bread here in Japan, unmatched. Un fucking match. I'm gonna. It's definitely one of the things I'm gonna miss. I like my pan dulce back home, don't get me wrong, but the Japanese bread is just like very savory. I love that shit. I prefer savory over sweet. And like the eggs over here are phenomenal. So anything with eggs, you better order that shit. <laughs> this is a very interesting area. This seems like quite industrial. That stadium right there? I don't think it's that one. There's multiple stadiums. So, let's figure out where we're going. So I think that's a little stadium. It kind of looks like a baseball field or something of some sort. There's multiple um, arenas here, I guess you can say. But the one I'm going to is that one right over there. It's the Todoroki Athletics Stadium, I believe. That's really normal for. It's gone. <laughs> All right, now, now the people are here. I don't know which way it went through. I obviously cut through like residences, residencies. But here are all the people. I was wondering where everyone was coming from. Yeah, um, this stadium isn't uh, too hard to get to. Yeah, so the funny thing is um, the first uh, hostel I was staying at here in Japan, um, I was like 10, 15 minutes away. Yeah, so it's crazy. I didn't think it through. I definitely... I mean, I didn't have any trouble for the most part with most of the stadiums getting to them. Some were longer than others, further away from, you know, the cities. But there was always a way there, whether it be a public transport, walking, it was fine. Yeah. The furthest one I would have gone to, and surprisingly I wasn't able to because of the whole 30th anniversary, was the one in um, Kashima, Kashima in Ibaraki. That one would have been a, a more of a hassle to get to. But, like I said, would have been worth it. Um, yeah, we're approaching the gates. Here. Per usual? Oh, they had takoyaki here too. Dang. I was telling myself I need to eat takoyaki before I leave. Takoyaki and ramen. That's all I care. This is good. I don't want to wait though. I have food on me too. There's a lot of people, yo.
It's a little hot. Can I get a brewski here or inside? Yeah, I think I'm gonna get a beer inside, guys. I don't really want to be struggling with it. Oh, I need to figure out where I'm sitting, too. Man. I swear, you could be a season ticket holder and not eat all of this, you know? Throughout the season. I swear. So much food. Like, how do you even go about it? Like, how do you decide what you want, you know? Like, it's just, at the end of the day, it's up to where you want. Well, this is fire. Oh, yeah, guys. Wow, this stadium is pretty nice. Let me go ahead and present it to you. Find a good spot. And then you can go up there and take a good little shot. Which I might. Let me go this way. Visitor Good Shop, that's so sick. That's cool. Oh, this is a store? So much stuff. Alright, guys, the last and final stop in the series, uh, the 17th stop. Welcome to Kawasaki Todoroki Stadium. Gorgeous stadium here in Kawasaki, Kanagawa. Yeah, man, this is the last stop. Um, incredible journey it's been. I am super stoked to go inside. I mean, look at that. It is brilliant. It looks beautiful from the outskirts and the exterior. So, look, and can't, I just want to sit here and admire it. This is my last stop. It's crazy. Oh, what a journey it's been, y'all. Wow, I'm about to just blow away through this league. league. This is my second league I'm finishing up, so, wow, it's been amazing. Yeah, I've actually been considering, not anytime soon, but I've definitely, I think I would like to come back to Japan and do League 2 and League 3. Yeah, just because there's so much to see and do, and I feel like the, the, the sport here is it's quite nice, it's quite um, interesting, it's definitely improving. Yeah, kind of similar to the MLS, but even here I feel like the atmosphere is just like pretty dope. I can't tell where the shop is here. We made it, man. We made it. We did it, man. Yeah. Oh, like 15 buses. That's sick. This is a dope stadium. What the heck? Alright, I need to figure out where I'm going. Oh, that's sick, yo. Let's go figure out where we're going. I think I can go through here. Let me double check. Like. All right, I think I'm in, guys. Seems like I'm in. Woohoo! I'm in the last and final stop. I made it, everyone. I made it. Wow. Yeah, this is a big ass stadium. I don't know if it's like big or it's because of the track that makes it appear big. Oh, this shit's dope. Go ahead and get ourselves a beer, yo. Did they get free refills?
<laughs> this is dope. Self service. So good. All right, we're good. I wonder if I can uh, top off though. But yeah, I think I am with the fan, uh, ultras here, guys. I'm just walking around the stadium real quick. Figured why not. This is blasphemy, yo. <laughs> That's so dope. I think I am with the ultras, yo. This is my seat, guys. I forgot. Um, yeah, <laughs> I purchased this. That's fine, though. Good start, good start for Kawasaki. Wow, that was really good. She went caught sleeping. Oh, I Almost half time, guys. I didn't see how many were added, but. It's a foul. Oh! Yeah. Go on. What happened? It's on the ground. It's a goal, but. Okay. Kawasaki makes it 2 0, guys. Ah, oh, sick. Oh, here we go. Oh, they're trying to rip What a stride. That was a penalty, too. Oh. Oh.
Kawasaki is at the video. Saki keeps the clean sheet and wins all. Wins the match two to nil. Takes all three points. Lovely time here, Kawasaki guys. I actually saw him play back in uh, 2019 when I came. Yeah, he played against Vissel Kobe. Kobe. We found two pins. Yeah, I'm just gonna get this one though. It's only 600. Alright guys, that's a wrap. Uh, end of the match. Ends 2-0. Uh, I got the prediction wrong, but it's all good. Um, great performance by uh, Kawasaki Frontel. Brilliant, brilliant stuff from them. Um, Kashiwa, I think they had maybe one or two at most, but they just weren't in the game today. Um, honestly, Kawasaki could have made it like 3 4 nil, but their chances didn't uh, yeah, end up in the back of the net. But overall, great performance. It's, it, it's a little disappointing that we didn't get to celebrate on my side. Uh, both the goals were on the opposing side, so that kind of stank. But... Nonetheless, the environment, the atmosphere was sensational. The stadium was pretty nice. Apart from the race, uh, the track, race track. Apart from the track, um, it's it's really nice. It, it was really cool. Um, but yeah, man, we did it, guys. Uh, we went through all most well, with the exception of Kashima. Uh, we completed the J League, man, the J One League. So fuck yeah, we got a little emotional towards the end. Um, they they were playing some singing some pretty good stuff and I don't know I just kind of like was taking it all in man a lot of things have been going down in my life and uh, you know I was just reflecting I'm like super grateful and appreciative of everything that's been happening um, being able to come out here um, for the past almost two months I'll say two months for the past two months has been an absolute dream you guys we have no idea so I mean I'm super grateful and thankful for everything that's um you know I've been living through as of late I've been meeting some great amazing people obviously watching some great football uh, visiting pretty nice football stadiums so yeah definitely enjoyed uh, my time here in Japan and I'm excited to go home but also sad that I have to leave so soon uh, my flight is tomorrow so yeah I gotta get back to my house so pack finish packing I might go to Shibuya, do some last minute shopping, uh, but yeah man, it's such a surreal feeling once you get to the end. It's like, wow, it's over man, it's over. <laughs> but um, it's not my last time here in Japan, absolutely not. I love this place way too much, and I really do need to start practicing my Japanese again, because yeah, I just, I, there was times where I just didn't understand what was happening. <laughs> yeah, but um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the series, I hope you enjoyed this uh, episode. Um, as always, thank you for watching, and I'm excited for the next chapter. Well, I have no idea as to what I'm gonna do. I have uh, a slight clue as to what I want to do, but nothing's uh, concrete as of right now. I'm considering going to Europe. Um, I'm not sure which country yet. I was 
considering Germany. But it's not till next year. It's uh, early next year. I think after the winter break is over, I think I'm going to uh, head over to uh, Germany and just do the Bundesliga. And uh, and I might, I'm going to do my best to try and stay through to the summer because I believe the, the Euros are going to be in Germany. So I'm going to try and stay for that, at least for a couple of matches. I know I'm not, I might not be able to attend all of them or, you know, but it'd be sick to catch a few Euros, a few matches in the Euros. So that'd be nice. But yeah, man, I mean, from here on out, I, it's going to be an exciting time. I, I don't know. I don't know what to expect, but I'm having a blast. I've been having an amazing time um, traveling and meeting all these places, um, the culture, you know, and the people. It's been an awesome time. And absolutely, Japan has been a real treat. So thank you, Japan. Thank you, um, you know, for making me feel so welcome down here. And yeah, hopefully your guys' football just keeps on improving. I will be back. And I, I, I also been... Um, debating whether I, I come back and do the J2 and J3 leagues just because there's so much to do and see here in Japan so even those little towns like I was in Kitakyushu they have a freaking team there and they had an extraordinary stadium and I was like you know what I think I might do that I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that Matsumoto had a team I visited them um, the city I visited those cities um, I think uh, Okayama all these towns have like these pretty cool football clubs as well and their culture is pretty chill too so I might go ahead and do that but yeah I'm gonna start taking off I need to figure out which way I'm gonna go special thanks to all of you who are uh, subscribers and tu uh, tune in you know every time I drop a video so I appreciate you guys for watching if you're new to the ride welcome along I hope you are enjoying the series the past couple of series the latest one and I'm looking very much forward to the next. Uh, I hope you are as well. Uh, in the meantime, you know, uh, be patient with me. Uh, you know, I wish I could just hop on right on to the next one. And also, the leagues are over. They're coming to an end, so, yeah. But anyways, yeah, live from Japan. We did it, guys. Hope I'll run and conquer the J1 league. Till next time, hope I'll run and out. I'm